Hello guys and welcome to another Premiere Pro tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add timers and countdowns in Premiere Pro. So to get started, I added a video clip onto my timeline over here. And the first thing you need to do is to create a new transparent video. So you come over to this new item here inside your project panel. Select this new item and select transparent video and hit OK. Now drag this transparent video onto your timeline and set the duration of this transparent video to the duration you want your countdown to become. So I want mine to be at 30 seconds, so I'm going to move this to 30 seconds. Next, move your playhead to the very beginning of your video clip and move over to this arrow here and move back to your effects library and search for the time code effect. Now drag this time code effect onto your transparent video and you can see that the time code has appeared on your video over here. The next thing you need to do is to move over to your effects control tab and begin to edit this time code. Now under your time code, to remove this icon over here, you're going to deselect this field symbol and that will automatically be taken out. Now if you want to add backgrounds onto your time code here, you can increase the opacity over here to add a background, but I don't want that so I'm going to take that down to zero. Make sure your format remains at SMPTE and your time source, change it to generate. And it's going to start from 00, zero countdown. Now, under your time display, you set it to the frame rate of your video. So, I'm going to leave this the way it is. So, the last thing I can do is to adjust the size and the position. The four zeros here represent the hours, and the last zeros here represent the frame. I want to take this out. So, to take this out, you move back to your effects library here and you search for the crop effect. Now, drag this crop effect onto your transparent video here and adjust the left and the right position to remove the hours and the frame. So I'm going to crop out the right and the left portions of this timer. And if we play this back now, we have a basic time code display. But if you want a countdown, you want it to count down from 30 down to zero, what you need to do is to select your transparent video over here, right click it and hit on next and hit OK. Now select this nested clip once more, right click it and go over to speed and duration and check this reverse speed and hit OK. And when you hit it from the beginning now, you'll see it counting down from the highest seconds which is 31 seconds and coming down to zero. And that's it guys on this tutorial. Thank you guys for watching this video to the end. I hope you found this tutorial very useful. If you did, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to drop your feedbacks in the comment section. Thank you and see you guys in my next video.